Oh, getting so close now. Mm -hmm. We are just days away from the opening ceremony for the Paris Olympics. Hey, we've got the countdown clock out there that uh, shows that we're just three days and 20 hours, 10 minutes away from the moment that we've been all waiting for. And of course, that's what's happening with the opening ceremony in Paris. WTHR is your home again for the Summer Olympic Games. And our Anne-Marie Tiernan and Sam Johnson, they've left. They have just arrived in Paris. They join us with a look at what they've found since getting in France. Well, hello, we're in Paris. We made it. We didn't have any travel problems at all. No, in fact, we're great. fresh off the flight and we had to get to work because there was a lot going on today. Fresh off the flight, meaning we're not fresh. <laughs> but right when we got to the hotel, we found out that in a matter of minutes, there was going to be the diving press conference. And there are 10 divers on Team USA. Seven of them have Indiana connections. So you know what we did? We got over here ASAP. Yeah, take a look <laughs> at this video. You can see them all coming in earlier today. We're talking about the biggest names in diving. One one of them is Sarah Bacon. She graduated from Cardinal Riddle. She was an Indiana State champion. She's also a three-time world silver medalist, but she's never been to the games <laughs> until now. I was also much like Al and a lot of other people at this table, I think, planning on retiring after that Olympic Games. So um, us not making the team kept me around diving, and now I'm, I am an Olympian, and I'm just so excited to be here. <laughs> IU also had a strong showing today. We talked to Jessica Parado and Andrew Capobianco with IU. Here's what they had to say about their fellow Hoosiers. It's such an incredible legacy of diving and just in general, um, it's just the best place to get better at diving. Parado really is the veteran of the team. She just recently turned 30 years old. She's been at three games. The gold has been elusive. Perhaps this is her time. Yeah, and she told us she's got the day off tomorrow. They all do, so they're gonna enjoy a little Perry, and I think we should too. I think we should. I think we need to go unpack and get dinner. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Something. Take a shower. Okay. <laughs> Back to you. More later.